All right, good news. We uh, we won the die roll. And uh, bad news is we're in the Tron mirror. <laughs> this hand's good. Two pieces of Tron in a prism plus a couple of fatties seems fine. Uh, oh, my hotkeys are a little bit different. That's fine. It'll be fine. Uh, we're just going to get absolutely stomped here. Uh, the whole problem with this is that they their fogs actually do something. Like, if we play a bunch of guys, they start stuff and we don't do anything for the rest of the game. Also, we missed on Drawn. So, <laughs> not, uh, not optimal. <laughs> I'm not going to turn down two, two Tron pieces in the prison, though. Crazy if you're going to look in that and try to dig for Tron even harder. Um, all right. They did not want to counter. Well, <laughs> I got lots of colored mana. Ooh, crop rotation. Can't really cast that into open mana, but... Maybe they're just gonna, I don't know, play a Bonders ornament or something. I don't know. We'll see what they're up to. Oh. Huh? Uh, why did they tap the plant? Okay. Do they have crop rotation or anything? Ah, they're just playing out the color sources. Seems like the correct play at this point. Go ahead and get drawn. Um, I think I'm going to go Ornament into Allosaur. Oh, <laughs> that was a good spike. Okay. All right. Uh, well, we're gonna play. We're gonna play double boarding party if we hit a land next turn, which, you know, that would be pretty good. Ah, them hitting the Tron piece there is uh, is unfortunate, but maybe they'll blank on anti combat cards for the rest of the game. <laughs> oh, hopefully, the rest of the game is next turn. Anyway, gonna play my boarding party. Try to hit like a crop rotation or something. Nice. All right. Yeah, I'll go ahead and play that. Um. Okay, they're gonna fog here, I assume. Uh. Okay, they have. They certainly have the moments piece already. They're not digging for it, otherwise they would have dug it for it to try to find a, uh, a another spell to cast. Surely. Um, I mean, I guess I'm just going to play the stupid boarding party anyway. Uh huh. Wonder if they have the uh. <laughs> wonder if they have it. Well, as we can find out in just a second. Hitting a thriving grove isn't isn't the greatest, but roar. Just going bash. Oh, they have a removal spell. Oh, and a braid, I guess. Nice. All right. Uh, so they jump here, go to three. I don't have a way to do anything about that <laughs> if they go to three, but um, I guess I could just F6. All right. They're evoking. See if they have the flicker for Prism and Milldrifter. Ephemerate. Right. 
Okay. I like Flicker if they had that and Ephemerate, because that leaves you with double colored source for sure. So if you hit Teachings, you can just Teachings for Peace and then just lock, lock me out. So maybe they hit the um, the Flicker off of the Ephemerate. I don't know. Like it just comes down to if they hit an anti-combat card, I am dead. Like. I'm not going to come back from this. If they have blinked on anti-combat cards, or if they trim down on anti-combat cards too far, then I'm just going to win. Ooh, all right. It's 15. So I have to hit the last boarding party if I want to kill him this turn. Oh, I guess I can just mire. Never mind. I, don't. <laughs> I can just mire and then um, cascade into that. Always yield. Cast. Maybe I should have cast Altasaur. Hey, we did it! <laughs> and now they board in a bunch of stone horns and I am dead. <laughs> oh, good times. I don't want that. Um, self assembler Garbo. Let's get that out of here. I'm gonna put in a bunch of pyroblasts, just some minor disruption disruption from them. Um, it is likely that reaping the graves doesn't really do much, but pulse doesn't really do much either. Like it's hard for them to kill my creatures, and if they do kill our creatures, we have uh, well, we have two ways to bring it back. Uh, also, I have sixty one guards because. Uh, I cut a forest and it, it, I guess I didn't resubmit, but whatever. I guess that means I got a card. <laughs> uh, good old 61 card special. Uh, I guess I can't have 16 cards in my library, can I? Or in my sideboard. Bummer. Ooh. I don't think I want Gorilla Shaman. But, like, probably better than pulses. <laughs> sure, why not? <laughs> I guess pulse can get back lands. Like, if you crop rotate land early, you can, uh, if you hit pulse off of a cascade, you can get the land back. That's pretty minor. Hmm. <sighs> this deck is pretty fun. It's a shame that I'm going to get absolutely stomped in these post board games. Like, all they have to find is a stone horn and uh, ways to flicker it, or uh, mystical teachings, because mystical teachings just gets them a bunch of moments, pieces, and flickers. Of course, they also kind of gotta show up eventually. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we got 70 players. Pretty good. It's gonna be seven rounds, just just barely. Um, a lot of the usual suspects are in here. Some of them have uh, taken leave of the format while its issues get sorted out. Uh, this is garbage. No Tron pieces. No way to search for them. Uh, this is good enough.
trying to figure out which one I want to put back. Which ones. I guess with ornament, I can just cast either of these. But I felt sore. When it went down to five. So we grove on red. Now we've got stirrings to try to find mine. Uh, well, I'm just gonna play prism so I can go ornament to stirrings. This also works out much better if I find a um, crop rotation next turn. One's got a medium start. Not a bad one, to be sure. Oops, ornament into stirrings. Oof. 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 That's not good. Uh, well, I'm just gonna have to miracle into it. It'll be fine. Everything's fine. All right. Let's see if they hit the plant and then have another artifact. They do have the other artifact. All right. Oof. I should just play Ornament into Prism. Yeah, if I Miracle into the, uh, into the mine here, it's worse. Hmm. But I got to use all my mana, and next turn I can cast Boarding Party the, uh, the hard way. When did I board in? Fire Blasts? I guess I'll just do more red mana. I was hoping to hit the land there, because um, now I can um, boarding party. If I hit crop rotation, though, I I, I have to cast it. Uh, it's too it's too bad if I don't cast it. But now they can just counter my crop rotation, and I'm down to land. Well, do 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 do. I just unwind it, and I'll wish I had Pyroblast up, but, oh, didn't expect that. Uh, what? <laughs> what in the world? <laughs> I'm going to put my boarding party back on top. I, maybe they have an, a land destruction spell and they just didn't cast it last turn for no reason. What the hell is this? Sure. Okay. I figured they'd have better cards than that, but... I guess killing stupid 6-3 isn't the worst alternate mode. Ooh, am I gonna get to, uh... Sure. It sucks if they get a way to do stuff, but whatever. Um, I'll go ahead and counter this one. Oop. Uh, I want I want to cast blue spells so badly, but uh, I guess uh. I guess I don't get to do that. <laughs> Alright, go ahead and counter here. If they want to counter back and force through, that's fine. I don't want them getting... I don't even know. I guess Ancient Grudge and blow up my ornament so that they can start activating their own. Go ahead and play Colossus here. Use all my manas. Woohoo! I will destroy target permanent if it's blue.
Mm. Yeah, sure, why not? So you know one last card's boarding party. Why is this not an 8-8? Eight, eight? <laughs> it's like they took a look at Grissel Brand and is like, you know what? We can do better. <laughs> it 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 would not even be noticeably that much uh more unbeatable and limited if it was just a an eight eight, right? Oof. Um I guess I can just get Fingraph. Good bog. The graveyard kind of sucks already, though. I guess I can get Tower and start activating Ornament. But, I don't know. Seems more likely that letting them draw cards helps them more. I guess if I get Bog, I can turn off their, uh their wall getting impulse to try to dig to an anti-combat card. Thank you. Go to 13, and then they can uh, ornament up, presumably. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay. See if they're digging to anti-combat cards or just digging to try to close the game out. Okie dokie. Do 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 do. Uh. I guess I can just dumb and down some artifacts, huh? <laughs> so these, this costs it six to kill. Uh. So I'm short. Um, because I play it and then six and then. Five. So I can't kill both their ornaments. Eh. Let's see if they have a Hydroblast. <laughs> Alright. Um. Oh, it's, it's actually seven to blow up the ornament. Jeez. Why do people board this in? What is going on over there? Anyway, um, I'm just going to play Prism then. I guess we just can hold up mana. They flicker here. Oh my god. Alright, well. Uh, this is what I signed up for, losing horribly to the Tron Mirror. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, alright. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, that's not gonna matter. Whether he doesn't do anything, I'm going to be attacking for infinite eventually anyway. <laughs> the, the problem is, there's they have two whole turns where they have to worry about nothing. Oof. All right. All right. Yep. That's unfortunate. <laughs> nice. Alright, I like it. I dig it. They even have white mana, so I can't even blow up all their artifacts and try to scum them that way. Anyway. Um, seven. Yeah, I guess if I take the drawn piece, I can blow up both their... Uh, 
tournaments. Hurrah, hurrah. I'll block up the attack. Thinking the braid and then uh, blow up this anyway, so <laughs> letting him deal three isn't that big a deal. It's weird that they kept up the red driving aisle, but I guess they have three prisms, so it doesn't really matter. All right, I have enough to uh, get a redo if they flicker to prism, but um, I guess I'll just blow up their artifacts, make their job a little bit harder. <clears throat> I don't have an Altasaur, so they can start attacking me with the Mall Drifter, which is a bummer, but what ifs. I got nothing. <laughs> I guess they've killed six artifacts. They they are gonna have a hard time uh, eventually, but uh, you know, this isn't over. I guess it sucks that I only have one pyroblast left. I think that means the game's over. Um, assuming they find anything relevant. We are gonna get flickered so hard. Kabam, right here. Flicker these two. That they find a wall? No, there it is, okay. The hell? Mornwelk? Sure. What are you doing? You can't afford to play cards like this. It's like 90% that I'm going to get pyroblasted, so I'm just going to evoke the first small drifter. I haven't hit a land yet. Which is a little bit not optimal. Okay, fuck it. We'll just do it like this. How about that? Alright. Getting a pyroblast is nice. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm glad I evoked those mold drifters rather than hard cast one. Ancient grudge. Well, that's a bummer. Okay. Did I get away with something? I have a combat stuff. <laughs> that's that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Uh, let's just go ahead and play ourselves a Maelstrom Colossus. Yeah, sure. Let's recycle one of these mines. I'll just get a tower. Okay, <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. Oh, that's pretty good. Ah. 
Uh, <clears throat> I guess I should just hold up Pyroblast and just go for a medium attack uh, next turn. Ah, I just didn't cast them all drift or whatever. I like drawing cards. Is this results? Like, if they have a counter for my Pyroblast, they're just going to, uh, what the? Okay, there it is. All right. Um, I was like, how did they cast that? And they just tap land. Um, if they have a counter for my Fire Blast and I counter their impulse, and their only card remaining in their hand after uh, their impulse is the counter for my Fire Blast, they're going to use the counter on my Fire Blast, whether I'm targeting the impulse or targeting a card they get. So might as well just let the impulse resolve, hope they whiff, which apparently they have, um, because I don't think they're voluntarily doing this, uh, choosing that. This flicker. Do I counter flicker? Because they're going to flicker these two. I guess I will. Now, if they would, if they die. Um, yeah, all right. I'll recycle a mine again. <laughs> um, might as well just get a tower. I guess. I guess I'm getting to the point where I can know my cards, all of them. I'll cast them all, Drifter. I have two more boarding parties, so yeah. All right. All right, I guess one more boarding parties. Uh, stirrings, sure. Yes. Well, I'm going to bash at the Gorilla Shaman, I think. Yeah. Might as well just get as much damage in as I can. Are they going for all chumps? Puts them at two, but keeps their dignitary alive. All right. Fair. All right, miss. Just whiff. Easiest whiff of your life. Hey, we stole one in the mirror. <laughs> uh, all right. Uh, well, I got very lucky. There's a... Uh, there's a good chance that if they had hit anything on their impulse, I would just be stone dead. But we managed to get through. Hopefully, uh, we'll dodge the Tron Mirror or Walls or any of the other horrendous matchups for this deck and, uh, and we'll try to take this one down somehow.